Good morning. Do you need to go potty? Okay, come on. Come here. Let's go. Good morning. And welcome to another day with Leo. All right, good morning. Yes, you're so happy that you got to go potty, huh? It is early morning. I was hoping to sleep. <laughs> I was hoping to sleep in this Saturday, but that's okay. Uh, I can't really complain when I can when I can wake up to these little kisses, huh? When I can wake up to these kisses. So, one thing uh, about today is um, I'm going to be spending the morning with a friend, and that's actually something I wanted to talk about a little bit here. I want to have a little quick heart to heart with you. Foster pro tip number one, take care of yourself first. I, I think people have a similar saying when it comes to having a newborn or a baby. <laughs> hey Leo. But you have to take care of yourself first and that's the first person I neglect when I foster a dog. And what I mean by that, I tend to, and I hate to admit it, but I tend to avoid going out with friends as often or doing things that I really enjoy other than fostering when I have a dog that I'm taking care of, such as little Leo. And I do that because I feel guilty. I have this little puppy at home. You know, a lot of times they're still somewhat new and I don't want to leave them. I don't want to leave my dog. And it sounds silly, right? They're just a dog, some people may say, but I don't want to leave them. Um, but here's the thing. If I don't go have fun and I don't hang out with friends and do things that I enjoy, as a foster parent, I'm going to become exhausted. And what I don't want to happen is become overwhelmed and never foster anymore. So. I'm gonna take this time this morning. I'm gonna go get my nails done with one of my really good friends, which is not really something I do, uh, getting pedicures, but why not? It'll be fun, we'll have a really good time. asking yourself, why did I just let him whine? Poor puppy, I'm ignoring him. No, I was working on what I call self-soothing. So you can see him now. Uh, he's completely fine. He's chewing an antler and was able to, like I said, self-soothe. Why do I do that? He needs to be able to be comfortable, any dog, right? They need to be comfortable to be in the same room as you, but not necessarily be on top of you. It's important if you have guests over, if you have kids, it's teaching them independence. I just got home, I guess it's been a few hours now, I'm kind of winding down for the evening. I went and I got my toes done with one of my really good friends. I'll show you, I went with kind of a coral pink color. <laughs> uh, I'm not typically a pedicure, manicure kind of girl, but I love hanging out with my friend and it was actually really fun. So I might actually do these more often. And right now I'm sitting and watching, I hate to admit, The Bachelorette. I know, I get it. Oh, and I'm enjoying one of my favorite snacks, dill pickle sunflower seeds. Super weird, I know, but I love them. They're excellent. Go try them if you can find them. Before I forget, if you've enjoyed these videos, if you liked learning about fostering dogs or following Leo's recovery, go ahead and give a thumbs up or a like to this video. It should be right down below here. Uh, comment below if you have any questions or feedback or things you'd like to see on this channel. And hit that subscribe button. Again, I think it's right here. Really what I'm trying to do here, and I don't know if I said this in the first few videos I've posted so far, I wanna mainstream fostering. I wanna show the world that fostering dogs is not as hard as you think it is. In fact, it's incredibly rewarding, it's a lot of fun, and although challenging, it's a really great way to help others, save lives, things like that. So give it a like, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, comment down below. Um, even if you just want to ask some questions about what it's like to fostering, I'd love to help provide feedback. It really helps spread awareness of kind of this effort. And thank you so much for your support, especially for those of you who've really helped provide support specific to Leo. Mm -hmm.